Hey everyone, welcome back. It's time to talk about the four best tips and tricks to fix iOS 18.5. Better for not installing on iPhone and iPad. So, if you're having trouble updating to iOS 18.5, better for on your iPhone or iPad. Whether the update isn't showing up or it seems to get stuck, I have got you fully covered with some pretty handy fixes. That said, let's get started. So first and foremost, I would recommend you to check the beta profile or the enrollment status. Ensure your device is properly enrolled in the Apple Developer or Public Beta program. Since iOS 16.4, beta profiles have been replaced by a setting. To do so, you have to head over to the Settings app on your iPhone or iPad. Then you have to choose General. After that, tap Soft Update. Then you have to select beta updates. Now make sure as 18.5 developer beta or public beta is selected. If the option isn't visible, verify you are signed in with the Apple ID associated with the beta program. Then I will recommend you to force restart your device because it is very handy in fixing common iOS related problems. To do so, you have to press and release the volume up button. Then you have to press and release the volume down button. And then you have to hold down the side button until you see the Apple logo on the screen. And once your iPhone has rebooted, go to the software date section and try to install the software to check whether or not you have gotten a better at the problem. After that, I will recommend you to free up enough storage space on your iPhone. It's worth pointing out that not enough free space can prevent updates from downloading. Therefore, make sure to get rid of all the useless files to recover as much free space on your iPhone as possible. To do so, you have to launch the Settings app on your iPhone. Then you have to choose General. Then you have to choose iPhone Storage option. And then you have to remove all the useless apps, last videos, or even transfer files to iCloud or a computer if needed to recover as much free space on your device as possible. Make sure at least 8 to 10 GB is free for the update to install smoothly. And finally, I would recommend you to reset the network settings on your iPhone or iPad. If the update won't download or you are stuck on checking for update, resetting your network settings might help you get a better of the problem. To do so, you have to launch the settings app on your iPhone or iPad. Then you have to select General. After that, you have to scroll down to the bottom of the screen and select Transfer or Reset iPhone or iPad. Then you have to select Reset option. Then you have to choose Reset Network Settings and confirm it by inputting your device passcode. It's worth pointing out that it will erase saved Wi-Fi networks and VPNs, so make sure you know your Wi-Fi password before doing this. And that's about it. So, these are the best tips and tricks through which you'll be able to fix iOS 18.5 beta for not installing problem on your iPhone and iPad. Hopefully, you have managed to get a better of the problem and now you have successfully installed the beta on your device. If you found this video helpful, make sure to like and share it and do subscribe for more such handy tips and tricks and I'll catch you up in the next one. Take care. Bye-bye.